hunting prairie dogs in Wyoming. Years ago, ten, seven to ten years ago, my nephew invited me to go prairie dog hunting with his sons and my son up to Wyoming. And I had a, a lot of fun going up there. We'd go up and we'd shoot the prairie dogs and shoot the rabbits and shoot clay pigeons. It was a lot of fun. I love to take uh, McKay up with me. I've taken Brandon once, I think. Um, but anyway, shooting prairie dogs is a lot of fun with my sons. Uh, one of the one of the fathers, his name was Lance. Lance, he said the reason why God made prairie dogs and rabbits is for sons and dads and sons to go out and get to know each other. When I go up to Wyoming, a lot of times in the winter, uh, it's really cold up there. Of course, and there's a lot of snow quite often. But anyway, one winter I went up and there was it was really cold and it was in the spring, winter spring time frame. But there was no snow. But these white rabbits, these big white. I don't know, they're like big snowshoe rabbits or white hares. I'm not sure what they are exactly, but they're huge. Anyway, they just they just will be walking, they'll be running around out there, they'll be getting on the road, they'll, you can just see them all over in the in the black sagebrush. You can see these white rabbits where they would be normally camouflaged with white because of the snow. There is no snow, so they're just standing out like a sore thumb. All the I like saw 50 to 100 of these rabbits one night, and they thought they were hiding from me. I drove over one, straight over one, it was on the road, the dirt road. It was just sitting there, and I drove right over it and just stayed there. Didn't even run over it. And he just went over the top of it, and, and it thought it was hiding from me. So they're funny because they're all white in the winter. They should be shielded with the snow, but because it was dark, you could see them like, uh, you know, sticking out like white rabbits.